is Sonic's new Crave double cheeseburger better than the Big Mac? Let's find out. What to do, what to do, it's your boy Big Ben. We back again with something new. You already know if something new just came out, it's something new. We got to talk about what's going on, everybody. Today, we got a banger, guys. I'm checking out two places, putting them in a little battle royale, Mad Max style. Only one food channel, one food product can leave in this versus, guys. Sonic came out with this new Crave double cheeseburger, also a single cheeseburger. Guys, I got it right here. Shout out to my subscribers, Hell's Attack and Rod Dunn. They wanted to see this review, so I got you guys. But in looking up this product, and I'm gonna reveal it to you guys real soon, you know, I started thinking, you know what Big Ben likes to do, a little versus, and I thought, is this better than the Big Mac? Because they seem very similar. So I had to do a little versus, guys. And I will say, pulling up in the drive-thru at Sonic, because I got this Big Mac first, I felt like I was doing something illegal. <laughs> But let's get into this thing, guys. Now, as I unwrap this stuff, guys, I got a prediction. I'm not gonna let you guys know what I'm thinking, but if I'm correct, I know who's gonna come up the winner here. But here's a little package in here, the Sonic. Boom, little Big Mac box. Let's see what these look like. All right, so here's a top view of the Sonic product. We won't get the other view, but this thing has a bun here, two patties on it, two slices of cheese. We got the tomatoes diced onions, lettuce, and this secret Sonic sauce on here, right? Looks really good. And over here, we got that Big Mac, that traditional sesame seed Mac bun. We got the two patties. In between is another bun. We got one slice of cheese. We got that Mac sauce right there peeking out. We got the lettuce and the diced onions. I'm sorry, both of them got a pickles. Now from first appearance, top view, I don't know which one looks better. Let's get another view. All right, quick drive-by, keep it rolling. Here is that Sonic Crave double cheeseburger, guys. Look at that, two patties, cheese just flopping out, looking like a little leaning tower of burger pizza. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's what we're gonna go with. Now the tomato slices look pretty thin and that's kind of the ratio that I like right there. Now again, key call outs on this one, the tomatoes, extra slice of cheese, no bun in the middle. That's a little difference there between that and this Big Mac. Guys, what do you think? Here go the Big Mac right here. A lot of people have had this. This the OG on the market. Sonic is a little bit newer, but which one has better flavor? That's what we gotta find out. All right, again, guys, a little side by side. What do you guys think? Place your bets below. Who's the winner? Who's the winner? Who's the winner? All right, let's get into it, guys. I think it's only right that we get into the new player on the block, the Sonic Crave Double Cheeseburger, but one last thing I did forget, guys, is a price tag. This is what's a little different here. So the single Sonic Crave Cheeseburger is $3.99. The Big Mac is $4.39, right? But the Crave Double Cheeseburger is $5.89. So a little bit premium than this Big Mac. Right now in the Sonic app, you can get half off either the single or the double, so that's automatically a win. But again, they're priced just a little bit differently. Normally we respect the calories. I can't find out the calories on this Sonic Double Crave Cheeseburger. The Big Mac is 550. All right guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this first burger, the Sonic Crave Double Cheeseburger. If you've been entertained so far, make sure to subscribe. I'm always dropping new food reviews, guys. Here we go. This bite right here looks good to me. Let's do it. Here we go. Mmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Whole 360 right there, guys. Patties. Hit them. Tastes like a good burger at a cookout. Crave sauce. Hit them. We know what it is. It's at Thousand Island. Right away, guys. I, I got to get into some of my hypothesis on this battle. The two slices of cheese is doing it. That's the ratio that we want. Pickles, onions, 
Normally I wouldn't have got the tomatoes. I'm actually glad I left the tomatoes on. Sliced thinly, that's perfect guys. I gotta go back in. I got to, this is, this is hitting right now. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Look at that. That's a nice cookout burger right there. Sonic? Mm. Mm. I want to destroy this whole burger. So I got to pause. I got to pivot. Mm. The meat tastes original, guys. Again, backyard grill, something you do at home. This tastes very original, guys. Very original. Doesn't taste mass produced at all. Sonic, big fan of this right now. I want to destroy this whole thing. I want to shut it down. You guys know how I do on the channel. I'm going to save a bite, though. Cause I gotta, I, I don't know which way I'm gonna go right now. It's like a fork in the road. So now let's get into the OG baby. McDonald's said, come on now, Big Ben. We've been doing this for years. So let's see what this Big Mac is talking about, guys. I don't know what's gonna happen here. I'm nervous. This could be bad. Going on the flames, this could be great. But let's see, here we go, Big Mac. Hmm. Man. Okay. Mm. This is the flavor that we know, guys. It's the flavor that we dealt with for years, we loved for years. As you saw in the messy bite I had, Big Mac sauce busting everywhere. The flavors hit me right away on this thing. But being critical, I say, you know what? Was that the Big Mac sauce that was hidden and not really the burger? That looks great though right there. That looks great. Patties are definitely way smaller than that Sonic Crave. I'm gonna just keep it all the way 100 right away. McDonald's, y'all need to work on that. Y'all got a problem on your hands that you don't know about. This thing over here is a sleeping giant. Hold on. Mm. I got this down already. I hit a bite that didn't have that much mac sauce on it, and it's helped me crystallize my thoughts, guys. I'm gonna do one more bite of each, but I already know. I'm gonna let the cat out the bag. This Big Mac, right? What McDonald's did really well is their layer of flavors. This is like a burger pizza. Everything just goes together just extremely well. The mac sauce, the bun, the pickles, the lettuce, the onions, the actual patties themselves with the cheese, it just goes together really well. But this thing right here, the Sonic Crave double cheeseburger, I just need a little bit more of this Crave sauce. But right now, this telling the Big Mac to go kick rocks. Mmm. 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 Hey, turn that music up louder. Hey, Keisha, Keisha. I know y'all like Big Ben, what you talking about? This thing took me to a cookout, y'all. This thing took me to a cookout, y'all. New kid on the block. Bang him, bang him, bang him. Mm. This thing is hitting. I want to destroy this whole thing. Let me just make sure I wasn't tripping. I'm gonna give these scores up, guys. One more bite of the Big Mac. As far as I'm concerned, this fight's over with. Mm -mm. I'm calling off the fight. I'm calling off the fight, guys. This Big Mac can't compete, guys. The flavors are there. If you love McDonald's Big Macs, I know what you're talking about. Those flavors are there. The combination's there. Everything we love for years is there. I'm not disagreeing with that. Me and my boys, we've been watching UFC fighting from way back in the day, right? This Big Mac is like the Shaolin Monk, right? And all the gear, right? It got the form when the fight starts, right? He's ready to go. But then you get that real UFC fighter who gets a hold of him. Me and my boys was like, where your form at? Where your form at? Cause that form go out the window once you find a real UFC ground and pound fighter. It's a wrap guys. They can't compete with this thing. Look at them patties, the size of that. Come on now, get up out of here. Mm. It's over. It's over. Original flavors. Mm. Only thing I'll say about that crepe sauce is competing, but it's not taking down the Big Mac sauce just yet. It's there, but not just yet. 
But the Crave Burger overall, Big Mac can't compete with that, y'all. Scores, Crave, I gotta go with, oh, that's a good burger. That's a dang good burger. I gotta go with a 9.5 to be honest with you. That Big Mac, that's a good burger. You know what, I'm gonna say 8.5 just off of GP. Just off reputation for McDonald's, I'm gonna say 8.5. Could it be lower than that? Possibly. Could it be higher than that? Possibly. But those are my scores, guys. That Crave Double Cheeseburger, gotta be honest, y'all. Gotta be honest, I gotta keep it real. Between what's sitting here, I wanna destroy this Crave Double Cheeseburger, guys. No contest, no contest. Guys, that's the review. Hopefully you found it entertaining. Let me know, did I get it wrong? Did I get it right? Is the Big Mac the best Thousand Island type burger on the market? Maybe just the best burger in the fast food market? Let me know. Have you tried the Crave cheeseburger or double cheeseburger from Sonic? Let me know what your thoughts are. Let's keep the conversation, the little debate going guys. But for today, that's the review. As always, if you like the video, if you rock with me the whole time, please leave a like. Don't share once, share it twice. Drop a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see next on something new. And whether you're a regular or a first timer, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell reminder. Catch you guys next time. Peace.